Today we'll be making the sablé cookies, excellent and very easy to prepare. Let's see how to do. Ingredients for about 70 cookies. Two sticks of high quality butter, two and three quarter cups of cake flour, one pinch of salt, one teaspoon of vanilla extract or a pinch of vanilla powder, half a cup of white sugar, plus more for coating. First of all, take a food processor fitted with a metal blade. Add the softened butter that has been previously diced. the sugar the pinch of salt and the vanilla in this case I have vanilla extract but you can use the seeds from a vanilla pod or vanilla powder now close the lid and beat until creamy Here we are. When the mixture is creamy, sift in the flour. Then beat again until a sandy, crumbly texture is formed. Now that the mixture is crumbly, dust the work surface with flour and turn it out. Once nice and smooth, place the dough on a piece of cling film, flatten into a disc, wrap in cling film and let it set in the fridge for at least half an hour. The dough has set as you can see. Remove the clean film and knead just enough to form four lots, about one and a quarter inches in diameter. Then we'll return the logs to the fridge to harden to help them hold their shape when sliced. You may prepare the dough ahead of time and refrigerate overnight or put it in the freezer to speed up the cooling process. Try to make the logs as even as possible. After that, place them on a tray, line with parchment paper and cover with clean film. The logs are nice and cold, as you can see. So roll in white granulated sugar until completely coated with the sugar. Now, cut the logs into three quarter inch thick slices. Place these round cookies on a baking sheet that has been lined with parchment paper and bake at 390 degrees for about 15 minutes. As soon as you take the cookies out of the oven, remove from the baking sheet to stop the cooking process.
Our beautiful Sablé cookies are ready, crumbly and flavorful. Perfect to serve with coffee or at a tea party. See you next with the recipe.